Hi Leo, I hope you're all doing well. Welcome to your reading. So please keep in mind that this is a general reading and it will not resonate for everyone. Okay, for Leo, please. For Leo in love, please spirit, what message for Leo in love? I just saw the soulmate card. Maybe you're dealing with your soulmate here. Deep soul connection, but with toxic patterns okay someone's toxic in this connection let's see for leo silent treatment so it could be a period of no contact okay so what could be hurt here someone could uh could have went cold on someone okay block ghosted not wanting to talk for leo please <clears throat> message for leo distance so there's distance could be little to no contact here okay let's see for leo nostalgic memory so someone's definitely thinking about you okay even though there's distance between you two someone's very sad here okay missing you thinking about the good times could be watching you on social media okay could be vice versa okay you could be mirroring one another let's see for leo please hard to let go so this connection is very hard to let go you're having a hard time letting go of this connection or someone's having a hard time letting go thinking about you okay for leo please for leo soulmate yeah this card wanted to come out right because i saw it before yeah you're dealing with a soulmate here okay deep connection that is hard to let go you feel bound to this connection okay you are not able to find another connection like this one they are not able to find another connection like this one so for leo please marriage you could have been married with this person or, you know, this could lead to marriage. So let's see. For Leo, for Leo, please. For Leo, in love, please, Spirit, for Leo, in love. <clears throat> At the bottom of the deck, we have the Justice card, okay? Someone might want to be making things right, to make things right between you two, okay? Because they can't let you go, okay? They're having a hard time here without you. They don't want to be at a distance from you, okay? So, let's see. For Leo, please. For Leo. The Nine of Swords. Yeah, someone's not in a good head space here, okay? A lot of stress and anxiety, Sleepless nights, a lot of guilt, remorse. Why is the Nine of Swords? Sagittarius had the same card here in the same position. So you could be the Sagittarius. Why is the Nine of Swords here, please? The Seven of Wands. Yeah, someone wants to fight for this connection. But someone could be guarded here, okay? It could be hard to fight for this connection, okay? Because both of you, if there's distance, if... Um, you're not talking to one another, okay? So there's like a lot of obstacles and then on top of that, someone has toxic patterns. So let's see, for the seven of wands, why is the seven of wands here? The moon, so secret emotions here. Someone's definitely suffering in silence, okay? They're definitely watching you here, okay? Uh, yeah, this is Cancer or Pisces, but there's a lot of secret emotions that are not being revealed. Okay, but this could be you, okay, because this could be vice versa as well. But someone is like finding really hard here. This, if there's silence, they just want to open up communication, okay? So let's see. For Leo, the High Priestess, yeah. A lot of silence here. A lot of silence someone went silent someone could be hurt okay someone could be angry someone could have some resentment here why is the high priestess here 
the page cups yeah someone wants to open up communication someone's tired of the silence so one here is in the high priestess mode okay not saying anything repressed emotions with that moon card high priestess both cards of you know not expressing and then there's someone here who uh just can't hold back anymore okay tired of the silent treatment this is the apology card this is the you know i'm thinking about you i miss you because you know they're very nostalgic here why is the page of cups here so cancer scorpio pisces here why is the page of cups here the chariot and they want to see you <laughs> like they're like gonna break your barriers here if you have if if you're guarded they want to break your walls here they want to you know they don't want for you to be guarded anymore yeah you know i think someone here is just doesn't want to be in conflict with you anymore so just cancer here but yeah someone's tired of the silent treatment someone's just very unhappy without you they just want to come towards you here but you know i feel there's a little bit of fear here right because they don't know how you're going to be receptive to them okay if, if you are going to be receptive so let's see for leo please for leo the ten of wands yeah someone just wants to release these burdens okay ten of wands about completion someone wants to get over these burdens release it. they're tired okay they just want to open up communication and they want to see you here so if someone's really having a hard time with the nine of swords the ten of wands it's like really having a hard time here without you why is the ten of wands here ten of wands the eight of pentacles so they're willing to put in the effort okay yeah they're going to chase you with that seven of wands. It's a card of, you know, it's a, maybe they were a runner in the past. Now they want to chase you. Why is the eight of pentacles here? Why is the eight of pentacles here? The king of pentacles, Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn. So this is a very serious king here. So I don't know what happened to you in the past. Where What were the, the toxic patterns, okay? Someone's a king now and wants to put in effort. Yeah, because someone just really, you know, really misses you here. Very, very unhappy without you. Let's see. For Leo, please. For Leo. The Ace of Swords. Again, card of communication. Vic they want victory. This is also a card of victory. They want victory. They they might want to gain your trust here. Because, you know, there are definitely trust issues here. So, Yeah. They want to gain your trust. They, they want to be, you know, honest now. But they, they just, if you've not been in communication. And also, having better communication. Maybe, you, you know, if you, you had conflicts, okay? It's like ending conflicts. Why is the Ace of Swords here? Why is the Ace of Swords here? The Three of Swords, yeah rebuilding the trust here definitely trust issue someone's hurt here okay so the apology here right under the the page cup so could have been a third party here okay three of swords someone's definitely hurt and guarded but there's another one okay there's a person here who um wants to come towards you okay so you you could be the guarded one they want to you know they want to break down these walls and they want to apologize possibly for this pain here that they caused. Yeah, I think you're going to talk about it. So if you, you know, maybe you didn't talk about what happened in this Three of Swords here. Now they want this opportunity to, to clear the air here also about what happened. They're willing to put in effort, yeah, and end conflict. Just I feel like they want harmony, they want peace with you they want to end this pain why is the three of swords here the seven of swords yeah sneaky behavior yeah so this is like clarity you're gonna have you know it's about clarity 
and maybe now they you know they want to be to be honest with you now okay because they're this king of pentacles they could have leveled up here gained wisdom but so there was definitely a shift here okay because i i think this king was in the reverse very unstable in the past with this this is like really not good energy with that three of swords it's not good energy that's a lot of lies games manipulations like definitely yeah toxic patterns so uh there was a shift here okay i don't see it in the uh in the reading but someone wants to be honest with you now with that eight of so uh, ace of swords and they want victory yeah they they might i really really feel that they want to rebuild the trust here that's what i the feeling that i'm getting from this reading and they, they really really want to regain your trust here so it's up to you whether or not yeah because there's a lot of hurt here a lot of hurt from someone's deceptive behavior seven of sword seven of swords here <clears throat> so it's up to you whether or not you do want to okay and they want to apologize so it's up to you okay if you do uh, accept their apology or not okay so that's it leo i hope it resonated with you i hope you enjoyed the reading take care